Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Uh, now we're back with the actual Fallout New Vegas instead of, uh, you know, in this DLC. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and uh, go on back to, um, to the actual Mojave. Oh, uh, God, it's nice to be back. So now... Oh, uh, we should probably get our companions back. So, um, put a world map here. Uh, let's go ahead and, um, go back to Prim. Because that's where Ed is right now. So, let's go get that trusty little robot. Now, it's going to be interesting to actually use this stuff in the Mojave. Because, uh, I've only actually done Old World Blues on my uh, main account so uh, I kinda just did it and then uh, stopped using my well actually I did use the liar to like clear out some death claws but that's about it so um, so yeah I haven't actually used this stuff much in the actual Mojave and uh, it's kind of weird to see this stuff in, uh, in uh, you know, the actual game. So, anyways, let's go ahead, go down to Novak here. Uh, Novak, here we are. Now we can go and talk to Boone. Probably up in the tower right now. I don't know where else he'd be. Oh wait, he might be in his house. Let's go check his house. It's right here, isn't it? No. His house is right here? Yeah. Boone. Dude. Okay, I guess he's probably up in the tower then. So, let's go ahead, say hi. Wait, actually, okay, what I like to do is with Rex and uh, Ed, since they're both kind of like secondary companions, I like to keep my extra stuff that I don't want to carry around uh, in their inventory, so. So, you know, like, backups like this stuff. This is, like, stuff I want to keep, but, like, I don't want in my inventory, so. Uh, yeah. There, Ed. Have fun with that. And then, uh, I wanted to give him the teleporter, but. Oh, wait, it doesn't weigh anything, so it doesn't matter. Okay, Booney. Hey. Is it time? Yes, sir. I'm ready when you are. Sweet. Okay. Now. Okay, let's check our twist. Quests, I mean, not twists. Alright. Now. Okay, we have to go to Boulder City. Which is right down over there. So let's go to El Dorado. Okay, now let's head over. No way, I forgot Legion tends to show up over here. So, let's uh, take care of them. You know, those are both flies. Yeah, okay. Wait, how many Sunset Star bottle caps do we have? Okay, first, let's see if there's any Sunset we should drink. Yeah. Did we get any new ones? No, we didn't. Shit. Uh, we have 12. Okay, not exactly uh, riveting so far, but... We'll find more, eventually. Okay. Now, I'm not sure how long I wanna want this Fallout New Vegas series to go. 
uh, I could just go through the main game and then end it, or uh, I could also do some side missions as well. Maybe even all of them, if that's what you guys want. Uh, it just depends, you know. Anyways, enough with that. Let's go ahead and save here. Now we are at um, Rap Older City. Nice. It's kind of ready, steady, ready. Kind of looking a bit broke down right now, though. Fighting over. God, I love this weapon so much. Like, it's a pain in the ass to get, don't get me wrong, but... Oh, man, is it, isn't it worth it, though? It's so good. Such a good weapon. Mmm, my favorite weapon in the game right there. Well, at least for uh, energy weapon characters. Uh, my favorite weapon in the game for characters that use guns has to be either the hunting rifle or uh, that gun. Those are two really good ones, too. That gun is just so nice because, like, it uses cheap ammo that's really easy to get, but then, like, turns it into, like, a decent we got weapon. a situation with some great cons right now. The brass of McCarran has ordered me to lock down the ruins until it's been resolved. Mm hmm. So, uh, what's going on with the Great Cons? One of my patrols was on its way back from Novak when it came under fire from the Great Cons. They radioed for reinforcements, but instead of waiting for us, they chased the Cons into the ruins where they were caught in a crossfire. No deaths, uh -huh. but not all the squad got out. The Cons have Private Ackerman and Private Gilbert as hostages. Okay. Well, they might have something of mine. A platinum chip. Once the Great Cons have been killed or captured, you're welcome to retrieve any property they've taken from you. Uh, I could negotiate with them if you want. Normally I'd turn you down since I have no idea who you are. But considering that the hostages are as good as dead when we attack. Alright. I'm going to give you a chance to talk to the Great Cons. Their leader is a man named Jessup. If we hear shooting, we'll be coming in. But it'll probably be too late for you. Fair enough. Good luck. You're my best friend forever. Thank you. I don't know what to make of that, but thank you. Don't you guys worry. I have decent speech and high barter. I think I've got this. Oh, wait. Let me just save real quick. Go ahead and save. Don't know what the fuck he's doing. What the hell? You're that courier Benny wasted back in Good Springs. You're supposed to be dead. Well, I'm not. Believe it or not. And I think you have something in mind. Yeah, uh, about that. Where's the chip? Benny stole it right before he stabbed us in the back. He's probably back at the strip by now laughing at me. Ugh. Great. Well, uh, how about we talk about this NCR ordeal you guys are in right now? What's to negotiate? The NCR backs off, we walk out of here, nobody gets hurt. Um. Never mind. Fun. Goodbye. Please, tell me I have a meeting, people. Please. That'd be super nice right now. Mm. Well, thank God. Hey there, bud. I'm getting real tired of talking. Yeah, let's settle things here. Still going on about this, huh? Pretty sure I already said we want the NCI to back off and let us out. Free the hostages, or I'll have the NCR escort you out of their territory. I can't believe I'm doing this. But all right, the hostages can go. The NCR had better keep their end of the deal, though. Yeah, Here, they better. A souvenir for you. It's Benny's lighter. Shove it up his ass when you catch up with him. Sure thing, buddy. Goodbye. Yeah. Good morning. 
And uh, Murphy OD'd, so I don't want to take a shit. Hmm. Is that worth it? No, no, I don't think it is. I want to take a few things. Thank you, stealth suit. Go ahead, save. Always save often, guys, okay? I don't know how many times I have to say this, but I must, I, like, cannot stress enough, all right, the importance of saving over and over and over. All right, incredibly important. Unless you want to redo a bunch of shit when you accidentally die or something. I'm glad you were able to get my people freed, but there's a new problem. I just got orders to take out the Great Cons, hostages or not. The Great Cons let the hostages go in exchange for their freedom. My hands are tied. I can't go against orders, can I? If, you'll, if you have any integrity, you would honor the deal. You're right. The great cons are free to go. Good, good, good. Boom, two birds with one stone, baby. I'm accepted by both groups now. Thanks for the rescue. No problem. Man, I thought I was dead for sure. Well, you're not. Okay. Now that I know where to go, next stop is the strip. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Wait, first, uh, I have like a new arrangement at my uh, at my desk here, and now I actually have a timer I forgot to set. So, um, yeah, let me check how far into the video we are, and I can set a timer for when I need to end the video. I'll be right back. Hello everyone, uh, I'm back. I have my timer set, and uh, yeah. So next stop, uh, New Vegas. Um, yeah, that's going to be fun. Uh, yeah, I guess this is kind of the part of the game where you kind of just walk, which is a double-edged sword because it's kind of fun to see like new things and stuff. But uh, at the same time, it can also get a little boring. Personally, I don't mind, though. So, uh, I'm just going to fill this time with talk. That's what I usually do for parts like this. Um, well, I guess I could pause the video and, like, unpause it once I get there. Something happens, but... <sighs> I don't know. I'll consider it. Uh, but there is some stuff I need to talk about. Uh... So, uh, I did kind of just do, uh, episode 8 a few minutes ago. What the fuck? What the? Fancy meeting you here, friend! Yeah, uh, how did you get here? Just rolling along on my spurs. Looks like I just might make it to New Vegas after all. Mm-hmm. You see what happened in there? Yep. Guess it's just down to you and Fancy Pants. I wouldn't him. He looks all hat and no cap, if you ask me. I have no idea what he's talking about. Did you see Benny come this way? Fancy pants? No, I ain't seen hiding the hair of him since the Tussle and Good Springs. I'm sure he ran back to the soft living in New Vegas, though. Probably. Uh, well, I guess it's good to see you again. Yep, this is getting mighty embarrassing. People gonna start to talk. <laughs> eh, I don't like being followed, dude. No, no, it ain't my fault that Dorothy and the Tin Man happen to be on the same yellow striped road, is it? Guess not, but I don't know, I guess I'll see you later. Look me up when you get to New Vegas. I'll buy the first round. Uh... Okay, you're a robot, so I don't see why you drink alcohol, but okay. 
so I have this old tough book all right I actually have an old YouTube channel haven't actually been able to track it down yet but basically uh, I used to use that tough book uh, just to like watch videos and stuff it wasn't really used for much but uh, I took the screen out and I want to use it as an extra monitor but uh, in order for that uh, I need like a special part it costs like 20 bucks Hello. so you've done a good turn for the what? NCR now we'd like to do one for you there's an NCR emergency two-way radio you call and we'll come running damn thanks man here. the NCR has your back stay safe and good hunting thanks man nice oh good old Veronica no offense, but you look like you've traveled a long way down some bad roads. Where'd you come from? The grave. Huh. Well, in that case, I take it back. You look pretty good, given the circumstances. Yes, ma'am. Well, welcome then. I'm Veronica. I live in a hole in the ground. So you're telling me you live in a hole in the ground? Well, a bunker, if you want to get technical. Uh, I think it sounds more interesting my way. Sure. But I'm not there much anymore. I'm usually out here picking up food and supplies for my family. Whatever they need. Mm-hmm. So you just leave your family in a bunker? Up. Oh, oops, stink click. Yeah, I'm not worried. They can handle themselves. But somebody has to get the groceries, you know what I mean? And actually these days, I think they'd rather have me out here anyway. But that's a whole other story. So listen, can I ask you something on the level? Uh, yeah, sure. I had a run-in with this group calling themselves the Brotherhood of Steel. Pretty strange bunch. Do you know anything about them? Oh, yeah, they're uh, usually harmless unless you use advanced technology around them. Well, that shouldn't be a problem for me. I can't afford anything like that. Hey, so where are you headed, anyway? Oh, I'm going to go see an old, uh, <clears throat> friend. This is quite a journey you're going on, then. Must be an interesting relationship to have brought you all this way. Oh, it sure I'll be is. honest. You're the first person I've run across out here that looks like she can really handle herself. There are places I've never been to that'd be too dangerous for just me. What do you think? Maybe we could travel together. Help each other out. Hmm. But don't your family need you? Like I said, they can handle themselves. And I'm not the only one getting supplies for them. It's a big family. Sure, sure. Well, uh, I can't right now. Uh, what? Oops, wrong mouse. <laughs> Aw, you really know how to make a girl feel like a stray cat. But, okay, my offer stands if we run into each other again. Okay, Boone, I like you, man, but uh, I like Veronica more. Trust me, guys, Veronica is fucking awesome. She, like, lunges at people with this huge electronic fist. It's awesome, okay? She's she's probably my favorite uh, companion, so. But Boone is cool, though. So, uh, sorry, man. What is it? Hmm. Uh, I think we should part ways for now. If that's what you think. Yeah, that is what I think. You should just head back home. All right. Guess I'll be around Novak for a while longer until I figure out what I want to do with myself. See you around. Hey. Bye, man. Okay, so, uh, Veronica, get back over here. Couldn't get enough of talking to me the first time, huh? Yes, ma'am. I'm ready. Good. I would hoped you'd come around. Shall we? We shall. Now you're talking. One thing you should know first, though. I ask you about the Brotherhood because I'm one of them. Uh -huh. I know, I know, but I had to know how you react when I told you. We have made a lot of enemies. You still okay bringing me along? Uh, yeah, but you have to be honest with me for now on. Sure, just don't ever ask me if your outfit makes you look fat. Well, thanks oh, for taking snap. a chance on a naive young girl from California with stars in her eyes and a pneumatic gauntlet on her hand. Let's hit the road, huh? Yes, ma'am. Ah, oh, God, my character is funky looking. Oh, yeah. Look at the gang. Oh, yeah. Dynamic trio. Oh, 
Well, time to head over to New Vegas. But, uh, yeah, I, you know what, I want to do the thing I was saying, uh, where I'll pause the video and then I'll unpause it once I get there, so you guys aren't dealing with this boring shit, so, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a minute. Hello, everyone, uh, oops, sorry, forgot about the control thing. So, uh, here's, uh, here's a place that I stumbled upon on the way. I honestly kind of forgot this place exists. Uh, I don't know why I'm pausing the video for this, but it's a followers outpost. And uh, let's see if we can get any missions here or something. It's been a very long time since I've been here. I haven't been here since I was like 12, so I don't know. I don't remember much. Here's the door. Let's, uh, let's talk to these fellows. I didn't know the Brotherhood had any people out here. All that wealth is wasted on the Strip. There are people in Freeside who need food and medicine. Yes, ma'am. Alright, um... Nothing? Really? Come on, there has to be, a uh, There has to be something here. Hmm. You, even? <sighs> okay. Well, that was very uninteresting. Veronica, move. Jesus. Okay. So, uh... Yeah, we're almost to the strip. I'll see you guys in a minute. Hi, everyone. Uh, we're back with this. Um, we're at the Gunrunners. Alright. Um, this is a place where they actually like sell weapons and stuff. It's pretty nice, except they don't sell any energy weapons, so... The only place it's really useful for for us is uh really like uh armor and uh place to sell our extra shit. Hello, potential customer. But I know how to actually farm for caps. Okay, basically uh these guards here, okay, you can just like take them out. Like uh Don't you Ready? Steady. Fighting. No, we could just, uh, we could, uh, hold on, wait, let's pick this here, ooh, don't fuck it up, ah, I fucked it up, um, shit, oops, oh no, uh, fuck, oh shit, don't do it, oh, mmm, this is great, I'm so good at this, Oh yeah, I'm great at picking these locks. I've only been doing it for three and a half Cessation years. Complete. But uh, no, no, let's uh, let's not be able to pick a simple Sneaking lock done. here. Fighting um, now. Yeah, but seriously, uh, you can just kill these guys. They'll like respawn every few days. Uh, Ooh. and that's all. And uh, it gives you free combat armor and uh hunting rifles which are nice because you can sell them to the to the robot literally in, right next to the place funny thing is the robot doesn't even care it's like a okay whatever welcome Kill our sir guards. or madam do you it's wish great. to purchase something i do this all the time it's a bunch of free shit you know it's now the combat armor is technically a little better than this when it comes to DT but this thing has so many good effects that uh honestly I'd rather just not and the this is about as strong as the combat helmet plus it gives us plus one endurance and health regeneration I think you guys are starting to see why this stuff is so overpowered not to mention this right here uh, gives us another four DT just just for free. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, they also have quite a few pretty nice weapons. Now there are there is reinforced Mark II's though. Now that is significantly better than this. Thing is this gives us so many good like perks. It's like uh I don't know. Six D T more though. That's that is a lot. Hmm. 
but I think we can stick to the stealth suit for now since we're still kind of early game here. Or we are pretty high level for it to be early game. Uh, I say early game ends after like level 10 where you get mid game until level 15 then you're late game. But the uh, thing is, since we did the old world, world blues stuff, you know, uh, instead of going by levels, I can't really do that anymore because, uh, you know, we're like way ahead. So, um, I'd say we're sort of still early game, but we're going to be hitting mid game pretty soon. Anyways, here we are in Freeside. Oh, wait. Okay, here's the, here's the thing. Yes. Hold on. Reach for the sky, lady. Well, you're awful close. Can okay, I buy that gun from you? This is the best gun in the whole galaxy. I paid a million caps for it, and it wasn't even brand new. Uh-huh. Yeah, but your heavy use has really deprived its value. It's only worth 20 caps now. Oh, man. It's Stacy's fault. She pretends like she didn't get hit. That's still a lot of money. I guess I'll take it. All right, goodbye. So long. Hell yeah. Okay. Uh, wait, have we been to Helios one? Wait, we haven't. Oh wait. Okay, we haven't been to Helios one. All right, when we go to Helios one. All right, this Poseidon, this Poseidon energy weapon right here. Okay, we got a. All right, jeez, fucking asshole. Uh, basically. <laughs> We can activate this thing at Helios Ready. 1. Steady. Where, uh... Actually, you guys can just deal with this guy. I don't really... I don't want to say that. But, uh... What was I saying? Right. If we go to Helios 1... Okay. We can activate this. So that it gives us the e EC finder or whatever. Which is an energy and uh, explosive weapon. So it's kind of like one or the other. And, you know, this is an energy weapons build, so we're good. Basically, uh, it'll send a huge satellite from the sky. Send a beam down and freaking kill them. It's great. Uh, thing is, though, I can only use it once a day, and it has to be outside, so. Well, for how powerful it is... I say it's still pretty nice. Okay, now, uh, we can't go past the gate uh, without paying 2,000 caps. And, uh, well, God knows I don't want to do that. So, uh, instead of dealing with all these guards, I could kill one, run over, grab the key, and then go into the strip. That's, uh, that's what I like to do, so. That's that's why you do every time. And once you have the key, like even when the guards respawn, you can kind of just uh run in there. What am I? Oh, there we go. Okay, sorry. Um. Sneaking done. Fighting now. Okay. Bad guys dealt with. Yes, sir. You look new to Freeside, so here's a little advice, friend. Don't go past the Southgate greeter without... Okay, without paying for it first. Bye. Uh... Isn't there a guy that tries to run in? Oh, yeah. Watch out! Yeah. Except, uh, difference is that guy couldn't get in because he didn't have a key. And, uh, we're faster than these fools. Sneaking done. Fighting now. Oh, too slow. Ha <laughs> ha. Fucking assholes. Okay. Howdy, partner. you come for a piece, haven't you? Sure Welcome have. Welcome to New Vegas. Thanks. This place looks amazing, man. Where do I start? The place to get started is not the 38. See that big old tower shaped like a roulette spinner? That's where you find Mr. House, New Vegas' head honcho. Ow, and fuck. he's itching to make your acquaintance. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, well, uh, 
tell Mr. House that I might stop by. Don't you dawdle, little doggy. Mr. House isn't someone you want to go about snubbing. He'll be waiting. That yes, sir. Dead. And, uh, I don't really give a shit. I'm, I'm gonna go and, uh, pay Benny a visit. Now, um, skills. Let's see here. What's my sneak? 32. Alright, so not exactly the highest. Um, let's go talk to this, uh, let's go talk to this shady guy over here. I have half a mind to throw you all in a cell and let you sweat it off. Hey, Jesus. Hey there, friend. A bit of advice. You look like you could use some protection. My stock. Yeah. Why would I need to hide a weapon? Some. Sure. Hmm. Maybe I could slip bigger weapons past the guards? An experienced smuggler could get a machine gun or pistol. In. You? You're welcome to try. Okay, well. I don't know, man. I would sure love, um. Sure love to get this in. That would be pretty nice. Um, let's see. I have Lash of May, right? So. Hold on. La Fente May. Which is French for the Phantom, I'm pretty sure. Okay, get weapons past the guards, no problem. You might. One fella I knew was able to slip a pistol past the guards. You? I'm guessing you could get a machine gun by it. Hell yeah. Goodbye. Stay safe. Yes, sir. Who do you think is cuter? Dr. Klein or Dr. Boros? Uh, no, no, I am not in the men. Oh, wait. I guess my character would be, because my character is a girl. Fuck if I know, man. Jeez. Those robots. Okay, here I go. Hey, hey, baby doll. Welcome to the top. Alright, here you go. Smooth and easy, just the way I like it. Don't worry, they'll be as safe as kittens till you're ready to leave. Okay. Oh, and a friendly word of advice. If you happen to stumble across any weapons during your stay here, well, just don't wear them openly. You dig? Now that we got yeah. that little business out of the way. Uh, yeah, goodbye. Have a good... Now, what kind of weapons do I get by? Alright, alright, I can deal with that. You know what? what? Anything to... Anything... Easy to kill Benny with. Here's the fucker, Benny. What in the goddamn? Let's keep this in the groove, hey? Smooth moves like smooth little babies. Mm mm. When you shot me, you ran off so fast I couldn't even get your name. You making a pass at me, sister? Because I'm out of your league. Oh really? Is it wrong to want a guy who'd shoot me in the head? Did those bullets scramble your egg? Or have you always been a naughty broad? Girls like bad boys, and you've been downright awful. Ooh You're boy. One sick pussycat, baby. There's Quinns, and then there's. I don't even know what to call you. Jesus Christ. I'm saying I dig you despite it all. What do you say? I hear dig from you, babe, and all I can think of is a shovel. How can this be? This ain't forgiveness. It's something wrong. <laughs> I'm a courier, remember? Don't you want me to handle your package? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> all right, honey, baby, this is all kinds of wrong, but to my sweet it is. Thirteenth floor, don't keep me waiting. The unluckiest number. Okay, best part is, I can just kill him after we sleep together. Yeah, so uh, this is this is probably my favorite way to kill Benny, because basically what I'm doing here is um, well uh, I'm seducing him 
And then when I wake up, I can kill him. Which works out, you know. It's one way to one way to get things done, if you will, so. Which one of his is there? Here we go. Benny. Benny's gonna show you the tops. I hope you're built sturdy, you crazy broad. Well, I took a bullet to the face, so. Hmm. Hmm. I have questions. The time for talk has passed, honey baby. These mouths of ours have appointments to be elsewhere. Oh boy. Hmm. I could kill him while he's sleeping. Yeah, let's do that. More than you ever dreamed, baby. Yeah, I'm not saying that line. No thanks. Yeah. You're platinum pussycat. You know how to swing. Nice choices too. Give him a shake for the Ben man, will you? Hello. What the fuck? Oh, that was a nice bit of hey hey, girly. You're a real ring-a-ding broad. Hold me, will you? I swear you wore me out. What the fuck? Oh, yeah. Killed Benny in his sleep. Huh? Oh! Yep, Benny, that's what happens. New weapon. And I got his clothes. Heh <laughs> Fuck you, Benny. Uh, oh my god, my sneak is five? Jesus. Yeah, no kidding. Um. Do I upgrade it? I'm not. I don't think it would be a bad idea to upgrade it. Hmm. I already have enough to make this uh, hard lock, and then uh, medicine's 35, so that's pretty good. Pairs 35. Yeah, let's upgrade this as much as we can here. Be a bit sneakier than. Uh, clock pick 69? Hell yeah. Okay, guys. Let's save real quick. Hey! Hi there! Good to meet you. What can I do for you today? What are you doing here? Good question! My function is to monitor Mr. House's data network and decode his encrypted transmissions. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a PDQ-88B Securitron, but you can call me Yes Man. Yes Ma'am? What, kind of, what kind of name is that? It's what Benny always called me. Probably because I'm programmed to be so helpful. Mm-hmm. Well, have you seen this chip before? Sure. Benny had me look at it a bunch of times. It's a data storage device, kind of like a holotape, but a lot more advanced. As for what's on it, well, some of Mr. House's data transmissions made it sound like the chip could upgrade his defenses somehow. That's just a guess, though. The chip's a proprietary format. You need special hardware to read the data on it. Mm -hmm. There are two locations with non-standard hardware on the network. The Lucky 38 and an underground facility at Fortification Hill. I'd look there! So what is Benny planning to do with this chip? Oh, 
He wanted to kill Mr. House and use the platinum chip to copy my neurocomputational matrix onto the Lucky 38's mainframe. That would give me control over all of Mr. House's defenses, most prominently the Securitrons. And then I guess I just do as I'm told. You're very forthcoming with this information. I was programmed to be helpful and answer any questions I was asked. I guess nobody bothered to restrict who I answer questions for. That was probably pretty dumb, huh? Yeah. Well, say I killed Benny and I wanted to take over New Vegas myself. What then? Then I'd have to help you. I mean, it seems pretty obvious Benny wouldn't have wanted me to. But hey, not my fault I can't say no. Mm-hmm. What are the details of this plan? I'm rubbing my hands together here. Again, goal number one is to eliminate Mr. House and install my neurocomputational matrix on the Lucky 38's mainframe. Given how you're a new arrival, I also recommend that you get to know some of the region's tribes so you can decide how you feel about them. By the time you finished up all of that, the Legion should be close to attacking Hoover Dam, and we'll execute the last phase of the plan. Say Mr. House were to suffer an accident, how would that happen? It makes me feel really dumb to admit this, but I don't actually know. I've never been inside the Lucky 38. No one has. Mr. House is in there, though. It's the central node of his entire network. Well, I've been invited to visit. Wow. Do you have any idea how special that is? Red carpet treatment? Seems a little mean to use his invitation against him like that, but I'm sure it's all for the best. I mean, Benny mm -hmm. was always scheming about how he was going to get into the Lucky 38, but you already took care of that. Wow. The other thing you're going to need is the platinum chip. Which I have. You know, the one Benny killed a courier for over near Good Springs. Uh, what do you know about this courier Benny shot? I knew she was carrying the platinum chip, and I knew right where Benny should wait for her. That's why Benny oh. put me here, to monitor Mr. House's data transmissions. They're all encrypted, of course, but I'm quite a decryptor. Did you know that Mr. House spent 812,545 caps hiring salvage teams to find the platinum chip just in the last year alone? Of course you didn't. Or that there were seven couriers, but six of them were carrying junk. How about their exact routes and the mercenary teams that screened them? I knew all that. Pretty smart, huh? Mm-hmm. Well, a uh, news flash, I'm the courier Benny shot. <laughs> I know that's not true, because you still have a head. I am serious. He really turned. How I set that up, I feel really bad right now. Good. You set me up, now you die. I feel really bad telling you this, but I kind of can't die. I mean, go ahead and destroy this Securitron. Get it out of your system. The problem is that a distributed image of my neurocomputational matrix is backed up to the network several times a day, or when I'm threatened. I can't help it. There's a little bit of me in every Securitron on the strip. So if this instance gets destroyed, I just download to a new one. Mm -hmm. If I could stop it from happening, I would. I mean, your vengeance is going to feel so incomplete. So, uh, I have the platinum chip, remember? Of course you do. Sorry about that. And it's wonderful that you do. The platinum chip is the key to overriding and exploiting Mr. House's defenses. Did I just say exploiting? That's not a very nice word. Yeah, um... So, I should ask the tribes if they'll support a end of... New Vegas? Oh no, I didn't mean that. Who needs their support? The Securitrons will be all the support you need. What I meant is, you should get to know these tribes and decide which ones you like and which you don't. You know, shape the future of Vegas. 
Choose your neighbors. If you like a tribe, leave it alone. Or, if a tribe is nasty, or going to be a problem, go ahead and exterminate it. It's whatever you want to do. Ah, I see here. Okay, okay. So which tribes should I uh, <clears throat> get to know? There's a bunch. Some of them you've already met, like the chairman, for instance. I think you should visit the other families on this trip. The Omertas and the Light Blood Society, so you know what makes them tick. And there are some important groups farther from the Strip, too. Like the Boomers, the Great Khans, and the Brotherhood of Steel. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'll be in touch. I'll be waiting right here. Yeah, you'll see, I don't feel like going all the way back up here, so... I'm just going to, uh, save real quick. Just in case. And then, uh... I wanna kill him. With my robot killing machine. Three shots. Just scrap metal. Well, here we go. It's okay, guys. Uh, he'll respawn right outside the. The casino, and I don't want to walk all the way back up there every time I need to talk to him. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to kill you him. This crazy scene or what? I killed him so that uh, you know he would respawn outside the casino, which would be nice. The eyes of the mighty Kaisar are upon you. He admires your accomplishments and bestows upon you the exceptional gift of his mark. Any crimes you may have perpetrated against the Legion are hereby forgiven. Kaisar will not extend this mercy a second time. My lord requires your presence at his camp. Yeah. This is a trap. I want to take a lot of you out with me. The mighty Kaisar has bestowed upon you his mark and guaranteed safe conduct. If he wanted you dead, you would be dead already. Pfft, <laughs> yeah, right. See Kaisar by way of Cottonwood Cove, south of Nelson. The course of the course will be waiting. They act scary. Now, where's the other guy for the NCR? Hey, there he is. I have a message for you. It's from Ambassador Crocker. Very important. Here you go. Okay, yeah. Basically, I can side with the NCR or the Legion at this point. But we both know neither of that is going to happen. So, uh, yeah. Under the hood. Victor, hi. Well, howdy, partner. Good to see you again. Boss is waiting for you upstairs. So get him with the dog. Thanks, Victor. I see you brought some friends. Sorry, partner. But they're gonna have to stay outside. Ah, no problem. I ha I'll head up there myself. Come back soon now. Okay. I say we should take over Vegas ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking here. So let's go ahead and uh, talk to him. Where to, partner? Penthouse. Penthouse four. Come on, let's well, get a free 2000. Uh, snow globe collection. Not many people know this. If you have, in fact. Uh, I've got a snow globe. You do. Goodbye. So, yeah, that's it. The Lucky 3 is not open to the general public. Trespassers will be shot. Huh. You've been a busy courier, haven't you? You take your obligation to deliver a package very seriously. An ethic for which I am grateful. I will admit, when you ignored my invitation, I predicted negative outcomes. But you have a way of exceeding expectations, don't you? I well, do. enough. 
Let's have the chip then. Uh, ba 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 ba. Hold on, we need caps. Fine. Give me the chip, and I'll pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated Ooh. in your contract. How's that? Mm-hmm. Well, that's a great start, but below the market. Very well. Five times your delivery bonus. Okay, fine. Such a small thing, isn't it? And yet so capacious, so very dear. Decades of hiring salvagers out west to search for this little relic in the ruins of a place called Sunnyvale. Back then, anyway. That's where the chip was printed on October 22nd, 2077. It was to have been hand-delivered to me here at the Lucky 38 the next day. But the bombs fell first. Suffice it to say, the delivery was never made. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, well, what happens next? A great deal shall be happening. A cascade of events with you taking a central role. At the moment, however, all you need to do is take the elevator all the way down to the bottom level. You'll understand soon enough. Here we are in the basement. Step closer to the demonstration area, if you would. Yeah, yeah, in a minute. I expect you're well familiar with my Securitrons by now. The titanium alloy housing that protects its electronic core deflects small arms and shrapnel easily enough. Hold on. Ah, oh, shit. Hold on, guys. Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm back, and... Here's the thing I want to try, okay? Uh, this thing. It can take down force fields Step such as this. So, area, I want to see what happens if I, uh, shoot it. I expect you're well familiar with my Securitrons by now. The titanium alloy housing that protects its electronic core deflects small oh, arms and shrapnel easily enough. Its X-25 Gatling laser, produced to spec by Glastinghouse Inc., is deadly against soft targets at medium range. And for close-range suppression or crowd control, the Securitron is armed with a 9mm submachine gun. All of this you probably already knew. What you did not know is that these are the Securitron's secondary weapons. All this time, my Securitrons have had to get by running the Mark I operating system, which lacked software drivers for their primary weapons. Today, with the delivery of the Platinum chip, all that changes. Behold, for the first time, Securitrons running the Mark II OS. The M235 missile launcher gives the Securitron the ability to engage ground and air targets at significantly longer ranges. And a rapid-fire G-28 grenade launcher ensures the Securitron is deadly in close-range engagements. The software upgrade also includes drivers for the Securitron's highly sophisticated onboard auto repair systems. Altogether, the Mark II software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness per unit. The city of New Vegas finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. Return to the penthouse now. We have much to discuss. Like how I'm gonna kill you? I actually just wanted to... Trips to the basement are rarely ship. so educational, don't you think? Mm. I've since broadcast the upgrade to every Securitron in range of my transmitters. And I must say, it's causing quite a stir down on the strip. And you think the Securitrons could beat Kaiser's Legion and the NCR? Why would I want to go to war against the NCR? They're my best customers. If their leaders weren't scheming to steal Vegas out from under me, I'd have no troubles with the NCR at all. To secure the future of New Vegas, I must have your assistance. Yeah. I'm listening. The next step will require you to infiltrate Caesar's camp. 
Uh, so you want me to kill Kaisar? Absolutely not. Caesar is of great use to me. I don't want you harming a hair on that man's head, assuming you can find one. No, he's bald. So what do you want me to do? I want you to open a hatch in the basement of the derelict weather station atop Fortification Hill. Mm -hmm. You'll recognize it on sight. The hatch bears the logo of the Lucky 38, same as the Platinum chip. Alright, I'll do as you Here, ask. Here, take the Platinum chip again. You will need it. Upon arrival at the fort, it's likely that you'll be searched and the chip taken from you. Don't worry, it will come back to you. Yeah, so anyway, um, no, no thanks actually. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna open the chamber, yes sir. Now, this one looks pretty tough. Yeah, this one is tough actually. Yeah, unlock door, yes. Yup, Mr. House, you're done for. Cessation of hostilities complete. Save real quick. Oh, Mr. House. Alright, everyone. I want to let you guys know right now that uh, some people get kind of, uh, get kind of uh, disgusted by this part, so uh, I'm just going to let you guys know this part can be a little much, so yeah, I just don't say I didn't warn you. This man needs you out of the way. Your vanity project doomed to fail. Mm-hmm. Well, uh, you won't be able to control anything, but I'll let you live. No! Don't disable Cerebrum. I'd rather be killed. Just killed. Alright, man. Guess I should give you your final request. Uh, let me just kill you with, uh. I want to kill you with Benny's weapon. Not yours. I should kill you with this. Alright. And a boat. Lost karma. Well, that's just how uh, that's just how the wind blows. Oh, I guess I should search him. Penthouse. Engaging target. Sneaking down. What? Fighting now. Okay, I was about to say what Enjoy the hell. Time in That's all. Yeah, uh, Victor is gone. You know, I wonder what happened to Victor after this whole thing. Eh, yeah, whatever. Someone's coming out of the 38. Hi there. Come to get fleeced like a bighorn? Wow. That's crazy. 
show it later. Okay, where's Yes Man? Yes Man. Where did he go? Okay, I guess I have to go back up to his room. Hey, hey, baby, don't. Smooth and easy, just. Oh, and a... now the big. Goodbye. What kind of stuff do I keep now? Oh, just this. Fantastic. Those secure phones in our obituaries? Uh, let's go ahead. Talk to Yes Man. Let him know that, uh. Well, I killed Mr. House, so. Oh shit, okay, yeah. So, uh, that's the end of this video, guys. Uh, we'll figure things 